actually using generative AI to create these images is I'll type in a prompt and uh, get back a few different images um, that would be of slightly different styles, that would have slight, slightly different features uh, that were different. And I would then take all of that, um, throw away most of it, because I generated over 10,400 images for this book and uh, this book is only 45 pages long. So I threw away most of the images that I generated and kept only a very small number that I thought were high enough quality. Then I spent a lot of time editing all of those images to make them just right for my book. So it's a really long and involved process in choosing each and every individual image for my book. Mm -hmm.